Hello, my name is Giovanni and I'm gonna be reacting to Star Wars The Last Jedi's new official trailer. Let me just look for it. Um, I don't have any comments, but I'm sure I'll have some after I watched it. Just give me a second to refresh my ideas, please. Obviously, this is a trailer which, which leaves us with more questions than answers. A lot of questions, actually. And I'm not gonna talk about um, every single frame of the trailer, uh, because in two, hours, in two minutes and, and 30 seconds a lot of shit happened. So I'm just gonna mention um, what the... Um, what the key elements are, in my opinion. This episode is gonna focus mainly on Luke Skywalker, and and this is something that I'm really looking forward to, uh, to see Luke again, as a as a main character, as a protagonist, as a hero, hopefully. He says um, to Ray, um, "I've seen this power only once before." It, it didn't scare me enough then, it does now. So he's apparently talking about Anakin Skywalker, his father, Darth Vader. And, and we see here um, a potential link between Rey and Darth Vader, which is something really interesting. But I can't say anything more about that because that's the only thing that the trailer shows us. But this leads us to the last scene of the trailer, um, we see that Ray says, I need someone to show me my place in all this. And, and we see Kylo Ren giving his hand to her. So, uh, I believe this is a scene which, which worries every single one that watched this trailer. But let me tell you something. The editing of the trailer, the editing of uh, of old trailers, um, does not follow 
a precise structure, does not follow a precise order. For example, we can find a shot uh, from the beginning of the movie, then a cut and a shot from the, the end of the movie. Nobody is going to realize it. And, and this is an advantage of trailers, for example. So maybe Kylo Ren is giving his hand to another person and not Ray, and maybe Ray is uh, asking help, is asking for help to someone else and not Kylo Ren, even though the location of the two shots of the shot of Kylo Ren and the shot of Ray is pretty similar. Uh, it's a very uh, dark place uh, with the, with a dark atmosphere. But I don't know. I'm not one hundred percent sure about this, so I cannot say anything more. The fight between Phasma and Finn, I think that fight is going to be the most intense fight of the movie. We, we need to remember that um, this is the middle episode. The episode 7 was the introduction of the journey. Episode 9 will be the end of the journey. Episode 8 is just the middle episode. So um, um, it, it's an episode that serves to to, to develop certain characters and, and to develop the story so I don't think there is gonna be any interesting fight maybe with the lightsabers other than the fight between Phasma and Finn the last thing that I wanted to talk to you about is um, the presence of some new creatures in this trailer and if they are in the trailer, it means that they're gonna play an important role in this episode. Which makes me really happy, actually. Uh, because uh, this indicates that uh, the director, J.J. Abrams, uh, in this episode is not only focusing on, um, on, uh, on the main characters or on secondary characters. He's not only focusing on the storyline of the... Um, of the of the trilogy, but is is also giving space to to tertiary characters, animals, creatures, um, in order to uh, to form the Star Wars world, to make it more beautiful, to make it more interesting. Uh, so yeah, he's also working on the image of uh, of this episode, and I think this is a really positive thing. So yeah, this was my reaction to the new official trailer of Star Wars The Last Jedi. Uh, I'll see you later.